If her nomination is confirmed by the Senate, Court Appeals Judge Sonia Sotomayor will become the first Latino woman to be appointed to the U.S. Supreme Court. Like so many other lawyers, uh, never thought we would see a Latino or a Latina appointed to the United States Supreme Court. This, to me, is as historic as uh, the election of President Obama. And that is really, uh, from my perspective, something I never thought I would see to see. I would live to see. Judge Sotomayor began her lawyer career as an ADA in New York City. In 1984, she entered private practice and became partnered within three years. Her first job was with the district attorney's office. Uh, she knew the, the importance of crime in the lives of people uh, in her community. And I think that's why she was so committed to the idea of working in the, uh, the justice system uh, as a prosecutor. And then later she became a, uh, a partner in a corporate law firm. In 1991, Senator Monenehan recommended Sotomayor to the first President Bush who appointed her to become the youngest and first Latina judge in the Southern District of New York. And she was then promoted to the Second Circuit in 1990 by President Clinton. She spent a period of time as a trial judge. That is, that's somebody who hears trials just like you see on, on television every day. But then spent a period of her time as an appeals court judge. And that's, those are the people that hear appeals from the decisions made at the trial court level. So it's an entirely different experience. You don't, it's the kind of experience that is needed for the Supreme Court. In 1995, Judge Sotomayor came to be known as the woman who saved baseball when she ended the seven-month baseball strike that left the American public without a World Series the previous year. Well, the, what was at issue here was whether or not the baseball owners could, in essence, lock out the players. From her perspective, this was closing down the American pastime. And uh, soon after her decision, uh, the ball players were back on the field. People still remember that as the, the moment the judge saved baseball. But besides recognizing her long trajectory and vast experience, those who know Judge Sotomayor mostly admire her integrity and fairness in the courtroom and outside of it. You came up in one world, but she has lived in many, many worlds, and she's comfortable in all of them. She's comfortable with people of all sizes, shapes, and colors. She celebrates Passover every year because she has so many friends who are Jewish. Uh, but she travels in many worlds, black, white, rich, poor, middle class. She has never forgotten who she is, um, but she is not racist against anybody, and that's an offensive thing to say. Um, um, she isn't radical in any sense of the word. And she comes right down the middle. She calls the balls and strikes the way she sees them, and that's what you want in a judge.